Hi everybody, this is Gary Cooper giving uh, the Petter Bay report for the sport fishing out there in the Machosan area uh, at this particular time of year. Uh, it's what, it's October, middle of October right now. Some guys have gone off hunting. Some people have left the salt water and pulling their boats out. Uh, but you know, a lot of times I find the fishing starting from now through the winter is a lot better than what we've been receiving in the summertime. And we get a lot of those, uh, the American uh, hatchery uh, Chinooks uh, all between five and eight pounds and they're all over the place out there. Sometimes you can't catch them, some usually you do. Uh, I like fishing about a constant bank uh, or if not, you know, you can drag, you know, just fish the bottom, fish the bottom a lot of times um, uh, and, uh, and you can catch uh, these fish. A lot of people, what they do is they say we like to troll in the mud. But you know, the big thing is there's still a lot of coho out there. The guys are catching two, three cohos. I've seen some uh, really nice limits of coho. And, uh, and they're big coho too. Um, so what you want, well, I, the way I like to fish for those, I like to fish with them with a fly rod. Um, and, um, and I don't use, uh, the only thing I do is use a lure uh, off the downrigger. I'll run the lure down about 40 to 60 feet. And, a lot, and they're catching them right now in about 500 feet of water. And not 500 feet deep, you don't have to be, but if you go out until, until you're in 500 feet of water and fish out there, in the Straits of Juan de Fuca, just out from Petter Bay, for example, and heading either east or at west, uh, you, you you should, uh, you know, get into them. And that's one of the reasons why I like to use a fly rod is because when you do hook one, what a riot! What a, you know, these, you know, you've got a saltwater fly reel and you've got an eight weight fly rod and you've got no weight on at all. All you've got is about a 10 to 15 pound coho that's peeling out line or coming out of the water. It's a great way to go fishing. It's a great, great way to bring home a table fish. But if not that, go out and get those Chinooks. Those uh, big, uh, are not big right now, but there's feeder Chinooks. And there are some nice ones around too. I shouldn't say there isn't because there are people who are catching teenage uh, feeders as well. So uh, get out there. Uh, they're usually fishing deeper right now. Unless you go to Constance, people are fishing the edges of Constance. But they're usually still fishing fairly deep for them. Um, and you can check with Island Outfitters on uh, on how it's been, but it has been good, and then all of a sudden it's not. But um, get out there and go fishing. Set out those crab traps. Have a crab. Have your own crab fest, and um, and uh, enjoy our fall. It's a great, great time. So uh, until my next report, um, have a good time out at Better Bay.